Upgrades to the locks and dams that keep our waterways open is imperative to keeping America's corn farmers competitive in the global marketplace. Many necessary upgrades were completed during the summer of 2020 to five locks on the Illinois River, but there are many more needed throughout the inland waterway system. This site was our poster child for old and decaying infrastructure. It was actually dangerous for my folks. They had to wear personal flotation devices out on the wall because there was no wall left to attach a handrail to. There was nothing between them and taking a swim. Uh, so that's getting fixed this summer. Uh, we actually, two summers ago, I believe it was, had to fish a piece of, the, of a, the, a monolith of the lock wall out of the drink in the chamber because it had fallen in and we didn't want it to rip a hole in a barge and end up with a sunken barge in the chamber. It was extremely bad. This system, the Illinois Waterway, runs 365 days a year. And because it does, we aren't able to maintain it well, like we are some locks on the upper Mississippi River system. About, above about lock 18 or 19, somewhere in there, that river freezes in and the barges don't run in the winter. And because they don't run, if we do water a lock over there to do maintenance, we're not affecting, we're not affecting traffic. And we're not, you know, there's not that negative impact to the navigation industry. So we have done regular, more regular maintenance on the Mississippi system than we have over here. This has been long, long overdue. For more information on our nation's inland waterways system, visit ncga.com or waterwayscouncil.org.